Johan Kabai, welcome to Crystal Palace Football Club. Thank you. Before we get started, just need to give you your new stripes. Thank you. Famous red and blue. <laughs> Thank you. He's nice. He's nice. You had quite a lot of clubs interested in you. What made you choose Palace? Uh, the thing is, uh, I know the gaffer. So I work with him and uh, uh, I met him at the end of, of the season and uh, I'm confident with him. So I just want to, to be confident on the pitch and I know with him it's going to be uh, uh, the, the, the fact. So I want to, I want to, to do my best for, for him because he... He did a, a big thing for, for me to come here, uh, even with the, the chairman as well. So I just want to, to thank to think and to, to say a, a big thank you for, for them because uh, if I'm here today, it's because of, of them. And what do you like about Alan as a manager? He's a good manager for me. Uh, he's close to, uh, to the, the players and uh, he, he talk uh, a lot, and uh, he give the, the players a, a big, big confidence, and uh, uh, he's a, a good, good manager. So we just want to, to 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 fight for him, and to to do our best for for the team. We had a great turnaround last season when he became our manager. Did you manage to watch much of the Premier League when you were back in France? Yeah, of course. Uh, um, I love. Uh, the Premier League f since a long time and uh, I get lucky to, to play for, for Newcastle and to, to know uh, how is the, the Premier League and um, yeah, of course uh, I watch every, every game, every weekend and uh, I watch of course uh, what Crystal Palace uh, done uh, after January because uh, I followed uh, Alan Pardew um, yeah. you know, of course at Newcastle but after that and uh, he did a great job since he, he came here with, uh, with the team um, and as I said I can't wait to, to start You've played at Sellers Park before unfortunately you played really well in a 3-0 victory against us uh, what was your experience with the fans at Sellers? Uh, I remember the, the f fans uh, we're singing whole whole game, and uh, uh, I don't used to to play uh, uh, in the other stadium in England like this. Uh, I was surprised, but uh, uh, it was a good surprise. Mm, I love the and I, yeah, I like the the, the stadium is uh, uh, for me is typical English stadium. And uh, the fans were were good, were really good behind the the, the team, and uh, they pushed them. Even where the Newcastle were winning uh, one, two, and, and three nil, uh, <clears throat> it was it was good. So now I can't wait to to play for them and to play for for Palace. Do you know any of the Palace players already? Um, were you at Lille at the same time as Pap Suarez? Yes, yeah. Yeah, I played, uh, I played maybe one, one and a half season, because uh, after he, he, uh, he went uh, he to, to, on low to Reims, yeah, so I, I know him, yeah, I know him. So did you start training soon? I think so, yeah. I uh, don't have a chat with the, the manager now already, so maybe on Monday. Mm. Did you get a long enough break this summer? Yeah, um, one more for a month. The last game was on the 13th of June with the, the national team. Tiller. So as a footballer, what position do you favour? Like more advanced, just behind the striker or sitting a bit deeper and kind of pulling the strings from there? I don't mind. <laughs> I just want to be uh, on the pitch. And if I have to play um, more deep, I can do it. I play like this for the, the, the national team and I know with the um, with Alan Pardew I can play 
as well more high on the pitch behind just behind the striker and I'm all right so I just want to be on the pitch <laughs> and finally have you got a message for the Crystal Palace fans yeah of course uh, I'm very happy to be here I uh, can't wait to start with uh, my new team with you as well and uh, I will do my best uh, to help the team and to I hope make you happy Thank you very much. You're welcome. Cheers.